Hey everybody, this is Bethany from Cranberry Horn. Um, yeah, it's definitely that full moon energy that's coming in. Um, I wanted to address something this morning because it was brought to my attention by a family member that um, some people view tarot uh, as practices of the occult. Um, I am not Wiccan, and it, I never have been. Um, do I believe that tarot is uh, the occult? No. Um, tarot has been around longer than recorded history. Um, as long as there have been people with questions, there have been people trying to find a way to answer those questions uh, and using different ways to look at them. If you, there are, are ruin stones and, and tarot cards and it became a fad in Victorian era for people to pull cards in, in a parlor. It's The thing is, it's about intuition. It's about looking for something that settles your soul a little bit more uh, because there's so much out there that is negative and, and scary for people at this time. Um, so I started, I, I've had cards for years and um, used them on occasion. I'm, I'm, I'm a beginner. I don't really know that much about them. And so this set out as a task for me to learn something as well as at the same time, it was a chance for me to make a video so that I would feel comfortable in front of the camera. So that's how this started, because um, I'm not really good with self-image, never have been very good with self-image. So this was a chance for me to do that and to find a way to be more comfortable with it. So... <clears throat> um, As I started doing these and I found myself opening up to intuition, my op opening my intuition more, looking at, at not just what's on the surface, what's beyond, looking at it, so much more of it is looking at personalities and archetypes and all these things that as a writer has always fascinated me. And all of these are a piece of that tarot. Never have I pulled cards with a negative intent. Always positive. In fact, that was really the message that I wanted to put, bring out there was that I wanted this to be a positive experience, something to look forward to in light of the negativity. So normally, if someone had said this to me, I would have ignored it. Um, it is what it is. People are going to believe what they want to believe. And, and, and I totally respect that. Um, if you, if you have a set belief that tells you that this is bad, then this is not the channel for you. And you need to find something that works for you. Hopefully it brings you that kind of positivity and, and gives you a chance to move forward. I hope it does. Really, the only thing I ever wanted was for, for the best for people, believe it or not. Um, and I really do hope that I do that with these rain. This is just a small part of what I was hoping to build with this. Um, my husband and I are gonna be going on a journey 
uh, next year. And I wanted to be able to find my tribe, find those people who were interested and could move forward with us and, and uh, were interested in what we were doing. And um, I hope that you will still stay. It's, it's up to you. That, that opinion, you know, there, there's an off button there. You can hit that at any time that you want. Um, uh, if what I'm doing doesn't meet with what you feel. Um, I'm not an occultist. I'm not a Satanist. I've never done anything like that. Um, I once was a Protestant. I was raised Protestant. Uh, <laughs> I am someone who believes in the greater good, who tries hard to see the best in people. And believes in people. So... So this is Fetty. He is my son's kitty and he is a very good boy. And he has a new brother who is around here somewhere but I can't catch him long enough to put him on the video. But we have a new seven week old kitten in the house who's a hellion. I mean, he's an absolute hellion. Uh, and his name is Milo. Uh, and Honestly, his collar is bigger than he is. <laughs> He's a little tiny thing. So, um, so where do we stand? I have another video that's all set to go for tomorrow. Um, I would really like to continue with them because, as I said, it's a learning process. And I like to learn things. You may see some changes coming down the road. I don't know. Um, but I hope you'll stick around. And um, I hope you all have a good day. Stay safe, stay healthy. And blessings from Maine.